Well, uh, howdy dudes, I just lagged right there at the very beginning. Um, welcome back to some more survival quests. Today we are solo, and, uh, yeah, so it's a little bit of one-on-one -on -one time with Hanster. Um, we're gonna, we're gonna talk a little bit. We're gonna talk about the series, the channel, different things of the sorts. So, I went ahead and I started repairing this. Um, earlier I was actually recording, but I got interrupted and had to leave. So what we're gonna go ahead and do... Let's place this over here and make another fence gate. But before we get into that, we are going to kind of talk about the series a little bit. So as you guys know, the, the main focus of the series at the current moment is to collect supplies so that we can defeat the Wither. That's that's really what we're working on doing right now. So, um, I don't know, there's this weird glitch in full screen mode that I'm having. Um, I don't know what it is, it's really weird, but we we're not going to get into that. Um, okay, we're gonna take some of this. And... So the ultimate focus is to defeat the Wither, right? So we are preparing to do that. And that should be pretty cool. And that'll be, a, that'll be an interesting fight. Hopefully we can get that soon. We have all the stuff we need to actually fight it. Uh, I think we're waiting off a little bit to try to get better armor. As you can see, mine's like disintegrating. We'll just throw this helmet on, because why not? <laughs> oh. So, we'll just throw that on, why not? Um, but as you can tell, we we, uh, we need better armor, so... Uh, we're gonna work on that. Let's actually go take a look at the shop real quick. Let's see. For one diamond, it's $500. So let's, let's see how much we have. If I could type correctly... We have negative money. Great. I don't know how that works. It shouldn't allow us to do that. We're gonna have to sort that out somehow. Um, either by selling a bunch of stuff, or I don't even know. Um, or maybe we can do a certain command to, to fix that. But, obviously something's messed up there that happened to Tyro. But, we, we might need to actually buy some stuff to make better armor. Um, that might be beneficial. So, don't know about that, but yeah. Um, I hate this stupid glitch where, like, the shift click isn't working. So I can't grab all of these, and it's so freaking annoying, I don't know what it is. Um, on another note, I'm thinking about upgrading the server to, to 1.7. Um, let's actually get another fence gate. We, we have the opportunity to, we can. But we just haven't done it yet, because, well, we don't know wood. Um, we haven't done it yet because of the plugins. The plugins were taking a while to actually upgrade, and it just wasn't really working out. So, what we had to do was just go into 1.6 for the server. Now that 1.7, like all this stuff has been updated for a little while, um, we could actually update. The only problem with that is, I don't know if the, like the homes that we've set, like the home here, at the treehouse, at the spawner, um, I don't know if those homes would continue over into 1.7. Um, like if the, the information would just carry over, or if we'd actually have to go through and, like, completely redo all of it. Um, as well as the, the, uh, ouch, ouch, hey, 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 no. As well as the shop. I don't know if the science would be all configured up again. We might have to go back through and change some of that stuff. And I don't know if that would actually work or not. So, um, that's kind of the issue there. But, I, ha I hate having to drag all this. What is up with this? I don't know what is up with this glitch. It's so annoying. But, whatever. Let's combine these two. This is like old school Minecraft and it's, it's super annoying. I don't know what it is. It's, uh, something with full screen, I believe. Um. But yeah, should we upgrade the server or no? Because that's really, um, the big question at the current moment. At least in my opinion. Um, we have the opportunity to. Should we take it or no? So let's go ahead and just continue crafting. Ignore the skeleton. Hopefully he doesn't kill us. Or he can shoot us. And we can come kill him. So let's go ahead. 
and continue crafting. We're going to turn down the music a little bit. Um, we'll leave sound up a little bit. So, we need to eat. Last time I checked, we were running really low on food. So let's go ahead and look and see if we have anything. We have some steak that can be cooked. Good. We'll cook that up. Um, as well as we need to get the farm up and running again. I'll probably do that off camera. But... Yeah, so we have the opportunity to uh, to upgrade the server to 1.7, should we take it? The only problem is everything might get reset, so we'd have to go through and set those up all over again, which could be annoying, but uh, if you guys want us to, we can do that, so yeah. Let's get a fence gate. Um, boom, done with that. And do we have a spot for sticks? No, we do not. Alright, I guess we're going to throw something out here. Let's throw the feathers out. Go ahead, where did the item frame come from? Apparently the item frame came off that chest. Let's go ahead and replace that. I'll just throw the bow out for a second. Run, throw this into our inventory if it would, if it would go. Alright, there. And... If we can get our bow back can move this over here, and boom. So yeah, should we upgrade the server to 1.7, or should we continue? I just realized I had pork coach up on me. Um, should we continue in 1.6? With 1.7, we could go to the new biomes, and we would have availability to all the new features. So uh, that's kind of why I'm interested in it, but not really sure. If you guys are, I'm not sure if Tyro is just bringing that to, to attention. So we got the portal all fixed up. That's pretty good. And let's go back in here and craft some blocks after we take out this Enderman. Because he is the other main focus of the series, which is to fight the Ender Dragon, bro. So let's take out the Enderman so he can drop his Ender Pearl. If he would quit teleporting away. It's like he gets really close and then he just teleports away. Because he's a little chicken. Where is he going? Drop anything? Nope. Alright, let's take out the zombie. Let's take out the zombie and the rest of the zombies and all the other mobs that are going to try and attack us. And then let's go sleep because that is that is beneficial to our health and it's definitely going to be helpful. So, should be, be, that should be pretty cool. Um, also, with my videos, I might be having face cams coming soon. Um, I just have to get uh, settings all worked up and stuff for the, the recording software I'd be using and I failed once again to, to craft what I needed to craft. Um, so that is, uh, that is a possibility coming soon and this glitch is really getting annoying. I need to find if there's a fix to it or not. Um, so we'll, we'll look for that after this episode hopefully. But yeah, so apparently we're going to have to drag these one by one into the pile. And so we're going to get at least 11 of these um, that we have to drag. And it's going to be freaking annoying. See, like, the shift click isn't working, so... I don't know what's up. We'll have to try to figure that out, like I said. But yeah, face cam might be a possibility here soon, which would be pretty cool. Um, and yeah, why not? Let's go ahead and bring this down, bring this down. We're uh, smelting this stuff because I thought it'd be cool to get a, a nether base going. Like inside the nether, we can create a base so that we can, well, not necessarily like a base, but just like a little area uh, when we come through the nether to, to just kind of chill so we don't get attacked instantly by anything and it would just be all nice and stuff. So we got a pigman here. I don't want to bother him. He will kill me. We're going to use our super god pig thing that we have here and just mine out right here. Boom. We'll grab some quartz. We're just going to mine out a bunch of um, nether rack here so that we can fill in a bunch of holes and stuff, um, which will be good. And we are full, actually. So let's head back up. Um, we, can't, we unfortunately can't pick that up. Let's toss out the glowstone to pick up the quartz. It's a, it's a pretty good exchange there. 
So what we're going to do is just fill in a few of these holes and just kind of take care of the stuff. So as far as the channel goes, for all of you that actually care about the the channel, um, uh, we got we're we're improving. We are um, we're growing. We're close to 100 subs, which is pretty cool. And I can't wait to hit that number. It's such a big number. Well, it's not like a huge number, but I mean it's it's a it's a big number for a person my size of a channel, you know. So. Um, that's that's gonna be pretty exciting. I cannot wait for that, and I think it's I think we're gonna grow even more past that. I'm really working hard on the channel um, to make the series that I'm doing even better, and to make quality and gameplay and stuff like that better, as well as getting some new stuff going up on the the old channel for all of you that are old school members of this place. So apparently, <laughs> the 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 thing is right down there. That's nice. The fortress that we've been to several times. Um, let's go ahead and fill this in. If you guys are new to the channel, um, well, I don't know why you'd be watching this video. Uh, it's more or less just an update survival quest video thing. Um, but it's uh, it's definitely a cool channel. You guys should definitely stay if you are new and uh, hang out. Join the join the the tan stars. That's that's something we're going to be starting up soon and. Yeah, it's just gonna be gonna be a cool time. So, um, what we're gonna do here is just build around of this, um, just a little bit. I didn't mean to dig out that much. That was kind of insane. Uh, Tanner and the God Pig. Um, fill all this in. Actually, I don't know if I need to fill all this in or not. Nope, we should be good. Well, we yeah, we probably should have filled that in, but, um. Whatever. That's it's good like it is. And boom. 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 And then we'll just fill the rest of this in area, like this area over here in. Uh just because, you know, it it makes it look nicer. Um having like a proper entrance to the nether, which will be that'll be really nice to have because well why do we need to come in and just like have pigment all over the place <laughs> right when we spawn, you know, right when we come through. So that's pretty cool. We got that done and stuff. So I wonder if that stuff continues smelting while we're in the nether or no. Guess we'll have to go check. But as far as the channel, like I was talking about earlier, uh, we're definitely working on improving it. I'm working on a custom texture pack that we'll use with 1.7 and then I'm going to transfer it over to 1.6 as well, uh, which will be pretty cool. So let's grab these bricks. Boom, those are all together, once again, and this, this glitch is going to be <laughs> super annoying, so we're not even going to play with it anymore. Um, you know what, let's go ahead and fix the farm real quick. This is more of just a recovery episode. We have no seeds, except for two. That's not good, so um, let's go ahead and a creeper. I don't know where I keep getting arrows from, it's like... I have them, and then they're, I don't have them. I think I'm picking them up from skeletons and stuff, and then we use them. Oh, so apparently Tyro did plant some wheat, or maybe it was me. I don't think I did it. I think Tyro did, and so this stuff will hopefully be grown soon. And actually, we'll just make some bone meal. We have 62 bones. It can't be that hard, please. Um, let's go ahead and make, obviously, like, tons upon tons upon tons of it. Because that's kind of important. So we have we have quite a few bone meal here. Now obviously it's been nerfed recently, well in the, the past few updates, so uh, it's not going to go as fast, but whatever. Actually, is it is it nerfed? Yeah, it's still nerfed. Um, it just wasn't growing all that slow, and it really confused me. So we're going to walk along the edges here, because I don't really want to jump on the crops. Because that would be bad. So we're just going to grow all these up to their full potential. I think we can actually walk on them, which is pretty cool. That's nice to to have, so we don't break them. I I don't keep up to date with these things. Um, and I was amazed that that one didn't break. All right, well that that's good. Let's go ahead and use the the wheat farm to our advantage here. And well, wait, we missed one. Boom. We still have 21 bone meal left over. That that's pretty insane. So let's go ahead and push the button and let it just destroy <laughs> everything and let it push it all down. Uh, to the edge to go into the the hopper. I guess we do have quite a few seeds in here, so we could have done and done that, but 
Uh, we, we were stupid and we didn't, so I didn't even check in there. Um, but yeah, Survival Quest, it's a, it's a fun series. I enjoy doing it. I think Tyro enjoys doing it too, or at least I hope so. If he, if he still wants to do it, I mean, obviously, he, he has to enjoy it. So, well, he doesn't have to enjoy it. Never mind, I'm just gonna shut up. But, uh, I'd like to get a lot more things built as well. Like, we have a freaking epic house over here. Um, which we could do, we could still do stuff with, especially up here. We can, uh, add, I don't even know what we can add up here, but I know, I think Tyra was wanting to make this, like, a second floor up here, which would be pretty cool, and stuff like that, so. And with the 1.7 generation, if we were to, to, uh, upgrade to 1.7, hopefully being able to keep this world, um, I would hope so. I, that's something I'm also worried about, is if it would delete the world. We could also head out that direction, hopefully, and find some of those new 1.7 biomes to get some of those new blocks or whatever, because that would be pretty cool as well. So, it's another thing we're taking into consideration, or I'm taking into consideration. Um, let's see how many blaze powder we have, because we've, we've done some blaze rods, at least I have five on me right now. It's quite a few. We have six blaze rods, and we can potentially make five eyes of ender. That's another thing we gotta work for, is the... Um, the uh, Ice of Ender. So do we have anything that we could potentially to sell for a good amount of money? Um, like something that we have tons of tons upon tons of tons of, um... We don't really have a whole lot. We could sell blue pickles for maybe a dollar each, but that would give us only a few hundred anyway, so... That's really pointless to do at the current moment, but... Uh, definitely in the, in the future to come. That would be something to take into consideration, so... Um, not really seen much else uh, that we can actually sell in the shop for a whole lot. We need to go mining. That's really what we need to do so that we can get um, some better armor, which that'll be uh, something that we have to do in the next upcoming episodes or off camera or something like that. So um, if you guys have anything you want us to build, let us know because we could definitely utilize this area over here for something. Uh, not entirely sure what. There's, there's a button here. I got really confused, so I mined in there one time looking to see if there's actually anything for the button, but there wasn't, so. Uh, must have just been something we <laughs> sat down for no reason, so. You know, uh, fun and games. Um, and, yeah, I think that's really all I really want to talk about. We got a bit done, not a whole lot, but we went ahead and we, we fixed the farm, which we should probably go check on once again, because it should have already pushed everything down, which should be good. And we can go ahead and pick up these seeds, since it didn't do its proper job. Um, we can go ahead and replant the the seeds, as well as we have some wheat now that we can use to um, eat, obviously. So, yeah, we can make bread and have a good old jolly time. So, we're just going to come fill back up the farm here and uh because that's what we need to do we need to we need to keep this thing uh filled after we use it just fill it back up it's not too hard especially with the amount of seeds it drops you know uh it shouldn't be too hard to to keep it all up to to date and stuff so now we just get to let this grow and as it's heading to the night time we uh we're gonna go to sleep and wake up in the morning and uh call it an episode there so let's go ahead and sleep ah so nice to finally get a, a good night's sleep, you know? <laughs> so, actually, we could start selling pumpkins as well. We have eight pumpkins. I'm going to start up setting up a, a pumpkin farm. That'll be pretty cool to set up, so. Uh, we'll definitely have to do that, and I will, uh, I guess that's really it. I'll, I'll catch you guys in the next video. If you did enjoy, be sure to hit that like button, and we'll, uh, talk to you dudes later. Peace out. Also, one more quick thing to note, I, I think I've figured out what's wrong with the, the whole shift-click thing, so if we go ahead, we can we can throw that in there really quick, see? Uh, what I had to do was I just went in and I had touchscreen mode on, so I turned that off, and I think that seemed to do the trick pretty well, so, uh, yeah, just the little update thing. Not that you guys really care, but uh, we've solved it, so that that's good. Alright, peace out, dudes.